to Long Meadow, my kids were young. When I come to Long Meadow, there was nothing in this town. Mostly in Agawam were the decorated houses. I, I have real hay in the manger. I had a carpenter build me that manger. It cost me three, four hundred dollars to have it built. And the manger is, that's really what Christmas is about. And it's come out good. So I said, ah, I'll do my own decorations. So I started and just every year it got bigger and bigger and bigger. But I did it for kids. First my kids, now I do it for all the kids. And there's kids that come to my house every night, the same kids, just to keep watching the display. <clears throat> the display. So I'll do it until I die. outside is when they have all the cartoon characters circled around a big Merry Christmas sign. My favorite decoration is the opening closing mailbox. supervise and I place every ornament where I want it and then they hook it up for me. But I design the whole every every everything that's out there. It's where I want it. This year here I consider it perfect and I won't make any more changes. by to look at the decorations, I feel a sense of pride because I helped do that. Oh yeah. Say that things can't grow beneath the winter snow But I've been under the weather and I never froze My two lips stretched and a big smile arose Gonna be open and brief about it so no case closed I was born on July 28th, was never a day We started doing the decorations the way they are now Because we liked it to go looking for decorations when my kids were little And there wasn't any. We had to go, We, you know, far and long. Like Agawam, I think, was a place where we had to go. There was one house that was decorated. So we just started doing that like that, you know, and it started little and we got more and more.
day here. My favorite part about doing the decorations is just the nostalgia feel because I've been doing it since I was really little. So it's just like being able to do it over and over again, just like, you know, having like all these memories just come back to me when I was a kid. That's my favorite part. You know, and uh, we just get excited. We like, we like to see the cars go by, especially when you see them slowing up and they look and we, we feel happy that we put it there, you know. I bring a lot of the decorations from the um, storage onto the lawn and I also stake the uh, decorations in so like you know the wind won't knock them over and they're safe so I just make sure everything's secure. Come now are all workers Uncle Carl, Uncle Donnie, uh, Uncle Ken does a little, uh, Auntie Joanne does a lot, Nancy does a lot and Sue. Sue does the least of the girls but she does quite a bit. And out of the grandchildren, Trevor is the best. Taylor is doing very good now. Nick is always there to help. Yeah, DITB1, BWS. Shit, you know, I don't even give a fuck. I don't even give a fuck how I sound. I, I just want to sign out. Okay, I'm trying to work my studio time, but here I go. Yeah, I'm a self-made savage. Eat your girl like salad. She done had it. Don't be mad, cause you never had shit. The lyrics I spit is fire and just imagine. I'm ignorant, do shit without asking. Call me Kobe because I I appreciate you coming and looking at my Christmas decorations. And I thank you very much for checking out all our beautiful decorations. And you must have a favorite one by now, too. So uh, I appreciate all you're doing, and it's for the little people and the older people. Older people like Christmas decorations, too, because, you know, it's like the old days. Uh, today is tough. People don't decorate like they used to. And I hope you tell everybody, or I hope you yourself, thought they were very nice. We enjoy them and we hope everybody else does.